Hi guys, today we are going to see how to use skip fish tool. It means now we are in the session of vulnerability assessment. In this vulnerability assessment session, we are going to use more than 10 plus tools to perform vulnerability assessment on web application. So guys, we know we have a tools called Burp Suit, Nessus to perform web application penetration testing, but these tools have to be purchased for more features. Now we are going to use open source tools to get much results like a purchase tools. If you want to be a perfect penetration tester, please listen full video and follow the other videos guys. Guys, now what is Skipfish? Skipfish is an active web application security reconnaissance tool. It prepares an interactive sitemap for the targeted site by carrying out and recursive crawl and a dictionary based props. So guys, this is about the Skipfish. It is pre-installed by the Kali. If not, the link is below to download and install in your operating system. So guys, this is about the skip fish and we have seen how to do scan with the Dalbuster tool and we have seen how to do scan with the burp suit and we are going to see the scan with the skip fish tool. These all are the tools which do scan on the websites to get the vulnerability information about that website. So these are the steps guys. Now we are going to do many tools to perform the website vulnerability scan and to get the vulnerabilities and try to get the exploit those vulnerabilities to get the backdoor access of that website. So guys, this is about the skip fish and this is about the vulnerable assessment on the websites. So let's start the practicals. Before that, I have started the WordPress site on my host. So you are able to see this is my WordPress host and this is my WordPress site. Now I'm going to type skip fish hyphen h for help to get the much information about that skip fish tool. You are able to see here authentication and access options is here. This section is belongs to the authentication access options and this section belongs to the crawl scope or options and this section belongs to the reporting options and this section belongs to the dictionary management options and many other options are also available performing performance settings and other settings. So guys, if you want much information, much advanced uh, testing you, if you want to do, please follow these uh, these options and you will get much results about that website. So I'm going to use normal scan on the my WordPress website. So I want to type skip fish iPhone O for the output and I want to create a directory or I want to create any file called skip fish one two three. This is my file and I, I will type HTTP for 192.168.1.5 is my web, uh, my IP address and I am, I am going to press the enter. Now it is showing guys some four options is here. You can read these four options. You will get much information about the options and what it will happen. So otherwise you can press any key to continue. So I am going to enter once and it is started. So guys, you are able to see here scan statistics is here and database statistics is here. So this is the scan statistics and database statistics. It has done the scan within the 19 seconds and uh, the total is 1224 KB and database statistics and uh, one server corporate statistics. These all things has given and skipfish123 index.html has given because I already done the scan on this website. So it is showing the very perfect result on within the seconds fraction of seconds it has given the information let's see where is our file go to the desktop or otherwise to the root folder it will available skip fish one two three here it is the one already i have done the scan here so this this is the skip fish one two three and we are we we have to go to the index dot fish where it is index.html we have to press that this is about the scan results we got so guys it has done the scan results like orange uh, 6 it means the indicator has given like the orange color and green color is 2 and the another one is 1 which is suspicious so the internal content embedded on the page higher risk it has given this one so HTTP localhost includes CSS library and the pub it has given the plugin details and uh, it has given the another information here you are able to see the in the red color which is which is giving is more uh, vulnerable uh, link 
so these are the things it has given and much information it has not given here so because i have to perform another time to the same scan i will get much information about the website so if you have any doubt about the website if you want to see much information so you have to do once again the scan you will able to see much information about that website so these are the steps on the skip fish we, we have to follow and we will get much information and much vulnerability details on the skip fish tool and we will see we will collect the every information by the tools has given to the vulnerabilities and we will place it one place and we have to analyze the vulnerabilities and we have to we have to find the exploits and we will try to exploit those vulnerabilities so this is about the skip fish tool guys and this is the third tool we are seeing what uh, about skip fish and we have to see more more than 10 plus tools it means we have covered three tools now we have to cover more than seven plus seven tools to do the vulnerability assessment the next upcoming uh, tools are uh, history tracker and web scraper and uh, sql map sql scan unit scan waps jab or oh, waps jab it belongs to the waps tool and uh, uh, we have seen the darbuster tool and nmap vulnerabilities also we have going to see and other tools also available we are going to see so these are the things we have we have to see guys so please subscribe my channel and please continue my channel and please share my channel thank you guys thank you for your support